<laughs> High five for Canada. It's 8.56, my guy. I know. Are you guys quick. seeing a video on shoes? Yes. Yes. What it's our shoe, that? our shoe rotation. What does that mean? So it's like every single shoe that we have in our closet, and then we just talk about each one. And you put this on YouTube? Yes. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Why? Like, what's the, like, what's the bench, like, what's the purpose? To get famous. Really? Yeah. No, no, it's just for fun. What's your thing on YouTube? Common apparel. Really? Common yeah. Apparel? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. So it's like it's meant for anyone and everyone. Exactly. It's cool. It's like it's meant for anyone and everyone. Exactly. Wow. Finally coming back to you guys with some content that you care about. My sunburn. Epic win. Ouch. Epic win. No, more like epic fail. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> What's going on everybody? Welcome back to our channel. This is Common Apparel. So last video we did a taste test. This video is going to be a smell test. So this is my gym shoe. Smells like the gym. Hey, where's the fashion channel? <laughs> this is what we do. Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. That was out of line leave a comment down below if that was racist we're doing a shoe rotation we have a lot of shoes so let's just get through this really quickly with the fucking ice cream truck playing in the background please tell me that's gonna stop i think it's kind of funny fine let's Do boost it. up the audio then so you can hear the ice cream truck because adam thinks it's funny so let's maybe put on a couple more songs about get kind of funny. can you start first actually sure so first up, we have the Vapor Max, Nike Vapor Max in triple black. This is, like I said in a video a while back, probably my favorite shoe of 2017. Uh, I wore these with like everything. There's a very slimming silhouette and a very like generous silhouette. It just makes your whole outfit look better in my opinion. It doesn't draw attention away from anything that you're wearing, but kind of complements it. Adam started with his sporty running shoe, so I'll start with my sporty running shoe. This is La Sportiva Bushido Trail running shoe. Um, it's a high performance trail running shoe, so every time I'm kind of like on the go, I'm running a lot of errands and I want my feet to be comfortable, I will put these shoes on. I love the color of the shoe, I love the yellow color, it's just um, not a very conventional color to have for a running shoe, and that's why I like it, it just looks different, it breaks up my closet quite a bit, even though I have another yellow shoe. I just realized, oh my gosh, I have two yellow shoes. Dude, you have three of them. It also has black on it, and a lot of my athletic wear has black on it as well, so just like a nice compliment for a lot of the stuff that I wear to the gym anyways, so it doesn't look too, um, like it doesn't stand out too much. These are the Nike Bonafides. I also talked about these in a previous video, and the thing is that even though they're in my current shoe rotation, they're not because I can't wear them. This is a Puma Fenty. So these are a pair of shoes that Rihanna, like her brand designed with Puma. They're just a pair of yellow shoes that are high tops, not high tops, sorry. They're a pair of yellow platform shoes with a pink kind of like stripe on both sides that um, Pumas have. I wear these shoes from time to time, maybe not really that often, but pretty freaking often. Like I wore them today, for example. Not often after we were walking through the mall and someone just yelled homo. Dang it! I honestly love these shoes a lot and um, I think that I pull off a lot of really cool outfits with them and I just, I really like the way that they look on my foot. I like the way that it makes my legs look. Next up, Stone Island Shadow Project Chelsea boots. Fun fact with these is that maybe two weeks ago I stepped in some shit. Really? But what usually happens with these is because there's like this, these huge gaps here. Ooh. Rocks get stuck in there. Oh, so oh. I thought it was a rock. So I just blindedly put my hand to like to finger the rock out, and it was just it was dog shit. And I had dog shit all over my hands and wiped something on your face. <laughs> no, I was about to. Say that. Say for the video. More views, bro. <laughs> so this is a shoe that I purchased from Simon's. And it's an Adidas Stan Smith in a mint colorway. The laces didn't come like this. This is actually something that I personally did to the shoe. I customized it this way. I was gonna do an episode on this for my channel, but I lost all the footage and I never made an episode. So this is what you see now. I Classic never wear journey. these shoes um, because I don't, like the color doesn't go with anything in my closet currently. If I do ever have something that goes with this, maybe I'll wear them more often. Another little thing about this shoe is that the leather, it has texture to it. I like that because they don't age as quickly because when you put creases on them, they kind of blend in. Last shoe for me, like all these shoes, it's a, it's an updated shoe rotation, but I feel like you guys have seen all these shoes for me. We had a, we had a sole video for this shoe. It's the Nike Air Force One SF1 Mid. Just a really cool like military take on the Air Force One. What they added was the zipper on the back and just some like writing on the side and the camo. I feel like this video is getting pretty long, so I'm just gonna go through the rest of my shoes pretty quickly. Doc Bartons, literally breaking these in 
felt like there were razor blades in like inside the shoe 24 seven. My feet were bleeding to the point where I had to put a band-aid on it and then duct tape all the way around that. What are they made of? Like why? why? It's just it's just this leather. It's just very stiff. Yeah. So if you ever buy a pair of these, just know it's gonna fucking hurt like a bitch. Next shoe is this. This is a shoe that I purchased from Simon. These came with black crazy. shoelaces, but then I put green shoelaces on them. I didn't know you did that. I, they look way better. I made these for a photo, which I've already posted to Instagram. Here it is. You can also check out the DIY that I have on my channel over here. Next shoe. This is a shoe that I purchased from Valley Village. I paid like $7. It's from a company called uh, Road. Uh, it has a Roflex sole, which is from my research, a very good sole. I never actually wear these shoes just because I, uh, this color doesn't really fit a lot of the clothes in my closet. This is a pair of Doc Martens that I purchased from a mall called Vaughn Mills. Vaughn Mills is basically like an outlet mall, so everything in there is usually marked down. I went to the Doc Martens store, which I didn't even know existed. Apparently that exists. And I purchased these and they cost me $70. I just had to take them because they're so adorable. I love these shoes so much, especially with the clear sole. Um, they're just a really simple pair of shoes that I really like a lot. The last pair of shoes is these. I beat these to the ground because I wear them very often, or I used to wear them very often before they got to this um, state. But basically, they're just a pair of Reeboks that I purchased from ASOS. And <clears throat> it's like the most Polish, Polish accent for ASOS. ASOS? ASOS. ASOS? ASOS? Asos. When they were in their prime, when they looked really nice, they were very nice and found their way into a lot of outfits um, in my closet. What shoes are you wearing now? Oh, I should have done that. Well, I'm going to do that, so good job. Couldn't do that too. I'll do it quicker than you though. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Literally a pair of slides that I purchased from Winners from Adidas. Like nothing to these shoes. The paint on them is not intentional. Dude, I was painting so while wearing them and the paint is still on them. I'm not trying to be like, oh, my uh. So, what I'm wearing is these really beat up Sweet Cokes. Sweet Coke Kissy V's, I believe is the, the name. Victor Gucci. What? What do you even say? Mr. Gucci. Victor Gucci. Everyone's starting to disperse from the park. Okay. That means we gotta go too because our the parents tornado. are waiting. Our parents are waiting in the car to drive us home. Yep. And the tornado is coming. So yeah. bye. Bye. Adam, start rapping. Blank with my blank, I let my blank blank. I let my blank, I let my blank blank. Yeah. Hey. I would start rapping the new Drake album, but it's trash. What do you think of Donald Trump? I love him. I don't know what you're talking about. Would it make a good Instagram photo? Yes. Yes. I'll move. Can you show me? I'm, I was memeing about the Instagram.